Maya. This is our foster kitten Maya and today I think she's going to be really happy because she's going to get canned food for the very first time and we know she loves to eat. She's had hamburger, she's had chicken, she's had bacon. Just a little bit of bacon. Just a taste. Um, and she likes to eat. And being a cat of ours, that's no surprise. She is a foster cat. She's available for adoption. We're looking to find her a very good home. And let's see if she likes this canned food. Maya, do you like canned food? What'd I tell you? Maya loves to play. One of her favorite toys is a string. I have a shoelace. I tied a little knot on each end so it's safe and she'll play all day long. But it looks like as much as she likes playing, she really does like eating too. Can you hear the purr? Well, you hear somebody upstairs? When she feels safe and secure, she is just an A-plus cat. So the owner has to, whoever does eventually adopt her, has to understand that when she discovers new rooms in your house, you need to take it slow with her. It's going to be an adjustment for her to move from our house to your house. The rooms in our home where she feels comfortable. She's just so lovable and so sweet. And the rooms where she's maybe only been a handful of times, we can tell she's a little more nervous, so we take things slower in those rooms. And we understand if she's jittery or if she, you know, on occasion if I surprise her, she might hiss, you know, when she's feeling really kind of scared. Plus we've got three large male cats and she's aware of them. But when she's in a room like for instance, the basement right here where she feels safe. She's just so cuddly and full of purrs. And she's going to make a great cat. Thanks for watching, Maya. She is blind in her right eye. But let me tell you, she is so active and agile that doesn't really affect her too much at all. So please know that she's playful. She's up for adoption by appointment. And she's looking to meet you.